Hey you guys, Tiffany here. Welcome to my channel. I am so excited because um, I got some new, I got something new that I thought would be fun to do an unboxing with you guys today. So if you have been around and you've watched our videos, you might recognize my, um, I guess that would be considered iconic because I wear them everywhere, uh, my blue rubber boots. Now, um, I've had these for a few years now. I originally got them for my photo shoots because I'm a wedding photographer and I tend to go places where there's standing water and stuff. And they've done really well. They are Nicole Miller's um, New York and I, I got them from Bells. They're cheap rubber boots. Um, I mean, they're kind of comfortable. I, I've never really owned any other rubber boots, so I can't say whether or not, like, oh my gosh, these are so comfortable compared to other rubber boots. But they, they've, done, they've done good by me. Um, I said the only thing that kind of sucks is that these, these plates, they have uh, little metal pieces, and one of them broke off, and... Um, kind of annoying because it tries to pop out and sometimes it'll rub so I can't wear these with shorts because they will literally they will scratch my legs so that's the only thing that I don't like but unfortunately recently this boot in particular got a crack and it's been leaking actually both of them have a crack I see forming but I decided to go ahead and replace them and <clears throat> I got a pair of jewels now these, I got these off of Amazon. I will leave a link down below in the description for you to go and order these. They have all different kinds of colors. Um, the reviews were really good. They seemed like a pretty comfortable, from what it sounds like, they, they seemed like they were pretty good. So I'm gonna go ahead and unbox them, try them out, wear them for a week or two, and then get back with you guys at the end of this video and give a full review on how I feel about these rubber boots. So, I got the, these are the Jules Welly Print, um, which color was this? Which, this was Green Lakeside Rose, I think is what it was. Yeah, Green Lake Rose, that's what this one was, Green Lake Rose. And so, I'm loving this box. The box is so pretty and it's got like a lot of like florals on it. And that is obviously, hence the name Green Lake Rose, that is the design that I went with. Alright, so let's get to it. I love this. So, oh my gosh, on the inside. So, they of course got the tag, Jewels Established 1989. And this is the Right as Rain collection. If there's some details. Oh, does this give you details on how to care for your rubber boots? Looking after your wellies. By following these simple steps, your wellies will keep their stylish look for years to come. Alright. Of course, obviously, regular, clean. Oh, they have a care kit. Something that I like this, because with the rubber boots, I kept seeing people saying, oh, they're too big for my calf. And, I mean, I don't have, like, big calves, but I don't have small calves. So this has an adjustable strap in the back that you can literally pop this off and adjust it and it widens pretty well so I know that I'm definitely going to be able to get this to fit on my legs just fine and still have room for comfiness. So on the front they've got their logo and it's really really soft. It's a matte finish. They're, they're super cute. I cannot wait to get these on the inside. Let's go ahead and pull this out. The inside's got like a striped pattern. That is so cute. They're very flexible. It's not like a very like stiff rubber. Very flexible will allow for pretty good movement. I'm working wearing these, like I said, to photo shoots, working in the garden, and I do a lot of bending down to harvest and plant. Let's look at the bottom of the shoes. We've got pretty good tread design and um, I got a size 7 which is normally my size so hopefully these fit true to size but I, I think these are these look pretty pretty well made and they got this cute little stripe down the back I just I'm, I'm really excited with this design so it looks like they're kind of mirrored so if you look at the patterns, they're they're mirrored, so they match each other perfectly. 
right, so let's go ahead and try these on. On. One thing that I actually really like about them initially already is that the inside, it's, it's soft. I don't know what kind of material this is, but it's soft. I don't have to wear jeans. I could wear shorts probably and be fine because sometimes I'll just be like wearing shorts and I want to go out to the garden. So I could wear these with shorts. So let's go ahead and try them on. Ooh, they have cushions. Oh, these have a lot more cushion than my old boots. Oh, these are a lot more comfortable. So, they fit good. Initial, in, initial uh, opinion. I, I like these already. There's good cushion in the foot. The legs are wide enough that I can easily slip them in. They're not tight. I can wear my jeans on the inside and it's not snug. Very comfortable and good movement. I bend down. It's not like pressing on me or anything like that or feeling tight. I'm I'm already liking these. So um, I will uh, give you guys a uh, update here in a week or two on uh, if I still like them. So far though, I'm liking them. All right, so it's been, uh, actually I think it's been two weeks now. I kind of pushed this behind. I've been really, really busy, but I have to say, I have actually been really happy with these. Um, like I said, super comfortable right from the get go. They've definitely, I've been, I've been wear, I wear these daily. So um, there's pretty much not very many times that I don't wear um, rubber boots because I, I have to go out there every single day. So, um, but the grip's awesome. I've never had any issue with slipping. Um, the calf, the opening where the where my calves are. It's wide enough, it's very comfortable, it doesn't feel restrictive even whenever I am wearing my jeans. I actually really like that because that's a common problem um, with rubber boots is that the openings for the calves, it's just too tight sometimes. Um, and because these are adjustable, you can actually make this opening, let me actually here, I'll undo this, but you can actually make this opening wider. So it's if you have a wide calf, these boots are definitely gonna be really, really good for you. Um, I have to say the only thing that I uh, think that I don't like about them is that whenever I bend down or like I crouch down to go when I'm working in the garden, these metal pieces, they press into the back of my legs and it's not the most comfortable feeling. So that's if you crouch, I crouch a lot. Um, but I mean, if you get down on your knees, it's, you can kind of figure it out. But I have to say that's the one thing that I've not been thrilled with with these. Maybe if they made changes and they put a, an adjustable clasp on the side. But other than that, I'm really, I'm really happy with these boots. They're really comfortable. I'm really glad that I purchased them. And um, this is not a sponsorship. I not I was this was not I was not reached out by the company. I just legitimately went to go look for new boots that I could afford that were nicer, comfortable, and uh, looked nice so that I could wear them for my photo shoots. And uh, these definitely fit the bill. I'm very happy with them. So I'll leave a uh, link down below uh, where you guys can find these boots. And uh, hopefully they're still on sale because I got whenever I got mine they were on sale. But, um, but yeah, I hope you guys like them. <laughs>